what's up my foodies welcome back to another video today i'm going to be showing you guys how i made this beautiful sweet chili jerk salmon so if you want to know how to make this guys then keep on watching Alright guys, so let's get into it. So this is a very very simple recipe. I'm using like six ingredients literally apart from the salmon. I'm gonna be using five different type of seasoning and my sweet chili sauce. Alright, so here I have my salmon freshly washed and clean. This is why it's looking so pale in color because I washed it with lime juice and vinegar. Alright, you could just wash this with vinegar but I wash my fish and meat with lime juice and vinegar at all times but you could use one you don't have to use both my skin is still on to my salmon because i love it that way and it adds flavor so i left the skin on and here i have my fish seasoning my all-purpose some maggi jerk some wet walkers with seasoning and my smoked paprika all right, so let's season the salmon, guys. This is optional. I'm just drizzling a bit of olive oil onto the salmon. You don't have to. And I'm just kind of wiping the oil all over the salmon before I add my seasonings, all right? So I'm going in with some all-purpose seasoning. Then I'm going to go in with my fish seasoning and my smoked paprika. Listen, the smoked paprika gives it a good color, so I love it. Now I'm adding some dry jerk maggi and the walker's wood wet jerk seasonings and that's literally it guys just massage it onto the salmon be careful you don't want to tear the meat because because we washed it in the lime juice and vinegar it's kind of getting delicate already so you have to kind of really be careful you don't overdo it and so the salmon starts falling apart when it starts cooking all right so massage your seasonings into your salmon and yeah we're going straight into the cooking process after this. All right, so here I have my pot, guys, with a decent amount of oil. You want enough oil to sear the salmon, so I'd say this is about a quarter cup of oil. All right, and I'm now going to add a scotch bonnet pepper. I'm just gonna kind of crack it with the tongue and rub it all over in the oil to flavor the oil because I want this to have a sweet and spicy kick. You don't have to do this if you don't want it spicy, but this is what I do to give it a sweet and spicy kick. So now I'm gonna add in my salmon. I'm adding the salmon in skin side up because I wanna do the skin side last so I could get some crisp on that skin you could do it skin side down if you want but i prefer to do my skin side last all right so we're gonna sear these bad boys and yeah this is smelling so so good already guys i love 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 this recipe it's quick anyway we're gonna sear these on each side for about three to three and a half minutes you don't want to sear it too long for it to be dried out guys all right so yeah all right so it's been about four minutes to be honest guys and i'm just gonna flip them over now this color is looking amazing listen i love 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 when my food has good color and this seasoning combination gave this salmon such a good color it's the smoked paprika and the jerk seasoning listen guys lit all right so we're just flipping them over and we're gonna get the skin side done and remember i said guys i want the skin side a little bit crispy so i'm gonna leave it for about four and a half minutes all right guys so it's about that time time to remove our salmon from the oil guys listen i don't know where that clip went when i removed that first one but moving along <laughs> This is the salmon all removed from the oil and now we're just gonna drain them a bit and then we're gonna move on to brushing on our sauce, my favorite part. All right guys, so this is my sweet chili sauce and what we're gonna do now is brush it onto the salmon. The brand of the sauce I'm using is Red Hot brand. I really, really love this brand. I'm gonna show you guys a picture of it somewhere here on the screen. It's just gonna pop up. But anyway, just brush, brush, brush on your sauce and your salmon. You could put as much as you like, guys. This is 
totally up to you and i love me some sweet chili sauce so i wouldn't be mad if you drown these pieces of salmon in it all right but i'm not drowning mine i'm just brushing it onto my salmon a generous amount all right we're not drowning it today <laughs> Alright guys, so here I have some canola oil. I'm just spraying it onto my pan and I'm just going to take my salmon piece by piece and add it to my little aluminum foil pan here. Generously guys, you don't want to manhandle salmon because listen, they will break, okay? So take them up generously, add them to your aluminum pan and we're going to head into the broiler. We're going to broil these for 3 minutes guys and I will be broiling these with my oven door open because I don't want them to burn. The sweet chili sauce is sweet and it contains sugar so they will burn and we don't want that so we're going to watch them. After 3 minutes guys our salmon is out the oven. Listen, it's smelling amazing, it's looking amazing and I know they taste even more amazing all right <laughs> guys i hope you enjoyed this tutorial don't forget to share my videos don't forget to like comment and subscribe tell a friend to tell a friend about taste of your guys and this is how my salmon came out all plated up nice and juicy and mm. once again guys thank you so much for stopping by always a pleasure having you here and i'll definitely see you in my next one bye